Good morning, this is Mission Control Houston. Welcome and thank you for joining us for today's edition of Space Station Live this Monday, August 19th. For the International Space Station is Commander of the Complex, Russian Cosmonaut Pavel Vinogradov, Flight Engineers, Russian Cosmonaut Alexander Mazurkin, NASA Astronaut Chris Cassidy, Russian Cosmonaut Fyodor Yurichikin, European Space Agency Astronaut Luca Pomitano, and NASA Astronaut Karen Nyberg. After a weekend of some light housekeeping and off-duty time, the Expedition 36 crew is back at work for a busy day of science research, some maintenance, and preparation of another spacewalk outside the orbiting complex following their uh, Russian record-setting 7-hour, 29-minute spacewalk on Friday. Flight engineers Yurichikin and Mazurkin are spending some time today to prepare for yet another spacewalk that is scheduled to take place this Thursday outside the Pure's docking compartment. The two uh, spacewalkers will venture outside the orbiting complex to replace a laser communications experiment with a platform for the installation of a small optical telescope and also to remove a docking target from the pier's docking assembly. The two cosmonauts are being uh, debriefed today on last Friday's spacewalk. They'll be reviewing their procedures for the next excursion and also installing equipment on their Orlon spacesuits. Meanwhile, flight engineers Chris Cassidy, Karen Nyberg, and Luca Parmitano are working on a uh, variety of science activities. Nyberg is working in the Kibo module. She had been uh, r removing a nano step experiment from the solution crystal, the crystallization facility, and replacing it with an ice crystal experiment. Nyberg has moved on to uh, another scientific research working with the uh, fluids integrated rack designed to host investigations in areas such as colloids, gels, bubbles, wetting, and capillary action including uh, boiling and cooling. Today she is working with ongoing colloid studies. Meanwhile, Cassidy conducts another set of tests with a sphere study. Sphere set uh, employs three bowling ball free-flying satellites known as Synchronize, Position, Hold, Engage, Reorient experimental satellites. These uh, satellites are used to test techniques that could lead to advancements in uh, automated dockings, satellite servicing, spacecraft assembly, and emergency repairs. And Palmitano has spent some time this morning conducting the uh, routine environmental health monitoring work today by measuring some sound levels throughout the station. He will also today be working within the uh, microgravity science glove box to conduct an experiment run of the ongoing in-space study that looks at the uh, changes of physical properties of colloids and fluids in uh, response to magnetic fields. And also each of the crew members will then uh, put in their daily two hours of exercise using the onboard gym equipment that includes a station bicycle, a treadmill, and an advanced resistive exercise device that simulates weightlifting here on Earth. The crew will then wrap up the day with the final daily planning conference with the ground. They will then have uh, time for dinner and a personal wind down before entering their sleep period. The crew is then scheduled to go to bed at 4.30 p.m. Central Time.